I felt a huge pop. And I, I said, that, that's it right there. So went in the dugout. It, it seemed like there was an alien coming out of my arm. Delabar's arm was broken so badly, doctors needed a metal plate and nine screws to repair the damage. His big league prospects went from one in a million to zero. And now a washed up ex-jock pushing point, 30, it was time to find himself a new life. And I was like, yeah, you know, I'm, this is it. I'm going to school, I'm finishing school. Gotta get on with my life. I'm getting, I'm, this is a new chapter. He went back home to Kentucky, took a substitute teaching job, and became an assistant coach on the school's baseball team. Eager to contribute, he began teaching the kids on the team a somewhat odd new strengthening program that was just beginning to be offered at a local baseball facility. But I wanted to learn the program to teach the program. So you didn't think you were applying it to yourself, to your own, your own baseball career? No, it was geared toward the kids. But a funny thing happened along the way. Doing the program, Steve Delabar's arm began to feel good again. Before long, as good as ever. So he began testing himself, using a radar gun to measure his arm strength. I initially test at 89. The second test was a consistent 93. I mean, I'd never been consistent 93 ever. I'm like, hey, this is legit. I retest again four weeks later, and <laughs> numbers skyrocket, 95, 96. And here you are, played in your elbow, screws, holding that in. And now you're throwing the ball better than you ever had. Ever. Ever. And arm feels amazing. 